When thinking about inherited pancreatic cancer, it's not that the pancreatic cancer is inherited itself, but more a gene that can predispose to pancreatic cancer. So if someone's inherited one of these pancreatic cancer predisposing genes, it doesn't mean that they'll definitely get pancreatic cancer. It just means that their risk is increased over their lifetime to develop the disease. Importantly, certain genetic syndromes also increase the risk for other cancers, like breast cancer, ovarian cancer, melanoma, and colon cancer. So when we take a family history, we're asking about all different types of cancers that could be in the family, not just pancreatic cancer. When documenting a family history, it's important for the clinician to know things like who in the family has had cancer, be it a mother, a brother, a sister, and also at what age they were diagnosed initially with that cancer. And the third piece is knowing where did the cancer start? So not where did it spread to, but if the person had breast cancer and it spread to the lungs, they had breast cancer, not lung cancer, and that's an important distinction.